Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Um, just a quick video here. I just want to be speaking about um, what it means to be conscious. So, I mean, there is a deeper way of speaking about this, but what came to me was you can't really be conscious until you've gone into the subconscious part of you. Now, in the in the vibe in the Bible um, and other scriptures like the even the, the ancient Greeks that they used to refer to the subconscious as the heart um, because that's where you feel that's your that's, that's what you feel to be true about reality it's not thought it's being feeling is being um, you know as you think if in your heart so are you you know um, they used to refer to the heart uh, subconscious as the heart and it says as well blessed are the pure in heart when you've decluttered like when you've lightened your consciousness you become freer so you become more conscious so like that's what it means to by be to be enlightened enlightenment is just be becoming lighter in consciousness you're letting go of all the stuff that you've inherited from this this reality like this three-dimensional reality that we're in um so yeah you're letting it out you're letting you're transcending your your it's your consciousness so to be conscious to be conscious is to go it is to obviously do the inner work the shadow work and everything else so because i thought what is this like what how does the subconscious what's the relationship between that and the conscious mind the conscious mind really refers to this the fruit that the, the, the three-dimensional reality that we're in now as in the physical world um and obviously they say that your feelings like your state of being the energy that you're vibrating on that mirrors back into the 3d world which you then consciously see right so really the real reality is the subconscious um but then when you let go of all the limitations that are there and they're in they're, they're within everyone um the more you transcend and the more you become enlightened, the more conscious you become. So what does it mean to become conscious then? It means, as it says in Buddhism, to become awake. The only definition of what it means to be conscious is to be awake. Awaken to your, to like the, like the dream or the hypnotism, the state of hypnotism that you were in all your life. Like, because it was subconsciously there. So it means to be awake. And that's what the word Buddha means. The word Buddha means the awakened one. So... I hope this is of uh, I hope this is of any help to people. Anyway, I hope this has helped people out and made people uh, feel a bit better about this. So, sorry everyone. Uh, everywhere I'm going, there's lots of noise. There's lots of noise, so I'll try to make this video quick. So, anyway, <laughs> I got there in the end. So this was like my fifth take of doing this video. Everywhere I'm walking by, there's noises. There's now there's noises of birds in the tree making noise, like there's the, crow, the crows in the tree. Everywhere I'm going, there's noise, there's, build, there's builders doing building work. Anyway, uh, <laughs> dogs barking around me. Brass quartet, quartet. Anyway, uh, I'll see you later. Bye.